Um, my name's Paul um, and I got my ABI first um, courtesy of a diagnosis with tuberculosis meningitis in 2008. I'm Cameron, 20 now, and it's my birthday very soon. She didn't have concussion or she, she didn't have any blackout or anything. But uh, she'd obviously done some sort of damage to her. My life um, has changed considerably um, versus before the ABI. I had my brain tumour, say, a year and a half ago, a year and a bit. Uh, when this first started, you know, uh, things had changed quite significantly. Whereas Sandy used to look after me because of my health issues. I was now having to look after her. My personality's changed. Uh, I get very tired. Um, I can come out with inappropriate things. It's working that I really miss. Uh, yeah, fatigue is the main problem, really. You know, there are things like uh, the, the lack of uh, balance and being up and thinking quite as quick and uh, things I loved doing before, things such as reading, um, such as um, uh, any, anything that involved um, intense concentration, which I would like doing, even watching like a long film, um, I can't enjoy uh, in the same way as I could before which is quite upsetting. The brain injury for one person is the whole family's injury in a, in a sense because we're all affected by it. The relationship and the interaction between my son and his family um, has become quite different now because they are far more aware that we both need support. I really I really can't thank uh, Headway enough um, for the, the change it's, it's made to my own um, perception of my illness. Um, I don't feel as alone as I did. At the beginning, because that's when I was first coming out of the operation, and that was great building on my confidence. Just, just enough to let me talk about it and walk around the streets a bit more and do a few things. Well, Headway is um, a sort of a confessional in a way. It's a sort of sanctuary where you can go and you can share with people who know what you're talking about. Very welcoming when I went in there, but the first thing that really resonated with me was the fact that everybody all knew exactly um, what I was feeling. And it, it just seemed like somebody from, from walking around in a misty fog or in the dark for the last um, four, four or five years. It actually just seemed like somebody had just flicked the switch on and it was just like a real, I, I, I literally walked away from that meeting and I was just felt like my life had changed. Uh, we're all looking for ways to uh, manage a difficult situation, we're looking for coping strategies, so we you know, exchange ideas. Nobody ever says to you, oh, you should do this or you should do that. But, you know, often they say, well, have you thought about trying this? Which is, makes a world of difference. 
my mum uh, came um, the first few times. Uh, when and still now, she she comes along and helps me get there and stuff. But it's I feel it's really helpful for her to come along to understand what it was to be like this uh, or to have an AVI. It's given us access to a lot of information and it's one of our little social highlights in a way. Yeah, each, each month you know, we, we do enjoy meeting these people and sharing with them. They're a lovely bunch. But more than anything, it's just being able to chat to people without any judgment, knowing that you know anything you say isn't going to be taken personally, um, and seeing all the love and support there from the other carers. Um, for me, it's just like it's very touching and incredibly supportive. The staff are absolutely brilliant. I mean, they give 101 percent, 110 percent. Um, they're really, really good. They go out of their way to do as much as they can to help. Thank you all for supporting West Sussex Headway and for helping us through these difficult times. Um, Headway has made life so much better for us in so many ways. I just want to say thank you so much for all of your support for Headway. It means so much to us all. Every penny counts and every penny will be used to support and enrich the lives of people with brain injuries. Thank you.